Hey, what's up? It's your homeboy, it's a little Rob, and I'm right here on Lossip.com. You can check out my new album, R.I.P. on iTunes. Pick it up, do me a favor, leave a review, let me know how much you like it. This is the next project right now, it's called R.I.P. Recording in Progress. It's been a while since I've been in the game, but figured out that this is what I do best, and this is what I know how to do, so uh, I gotta you know, represent for the people and put out some music that they like and uh, that they've been waiting for me to do, and um, do it the best way I know how to do it. It's called R.I.P. Recording in Progress, because I'm not dead. It's not rest in peace, it's recording in progress. What makes this project different than the last one is um, just, uh, I'm just more in the pocket this time, you know what I mean? I've always been good at what I do, but this time I'm really in the studio and just making sure everything's perfected and sounds really, really tight and, and, and good. It's my first time back in five years, so I want to make sure it sounds clean and it's bumping and everything just sounds correct, you know what I mean? Working with uh, Ceci B and uh, Eric Bellinger, um, we just happened to have a song called Don't Want to Fall in Love that we recorded in the studio. And it was me and uh, my producer, Mooks, and Mooks was singing the, the hook. And we just uh, happened to have some friends in LA that had the hook up with Eric Bellinger, and he was polite enough to jump on a track with me and, um, and help me out, so that was, a, that was a good thing. Ceci B just happened to call me up. I'm the kind of person that just can't say no, you know what I mean? So it was like, uh, I really to myself and just working on my own music and stuff like that, but uh, ended up being a good project. I looked at what she was doing, and I liked the skills, and then I heard the beat, and then, uh, with that, you know, mariachi kind of sound, I just jumped on it. I thought, figured that I would sound good on that, so maybe be able to represent and do my thing. What you can expect from me from the upcoming tour, just good music, feel good music, real good music, neighborhood music. I um, like to show people a good time and show that we're not just all cholos and gang bangers, but we're able to go out and have a good time. And one of the things that I like when I'm up on stage is when I, you know, I see one of the homeboys dancing with his girlfriend or whatever, and they're just like, you know, having a good time with each other. And it's not about fighting or nothing like that. It's about people coming out and having a good time. That's what I'm all about, man, a good time. International dates, I mean, I would love, I would love to. You know what I mean? It's been a long time and, uh, you know, I've got to go, go well, hit Japan, in like five different cities in Japan and Okinawa and stuff like that. So that was, that was pretty cool. So we'll just see what happens with this one. And I'm definitely open for jumping on an international flight and doing some other dates in, in different places. So but my, my Latino uh, hip hop influences. Back then it was uh, Proper Dose, a lighter shade of brown, uh, Kid Frost, uh, Spanish Fry from the Harbor area. That's a rich rock and dance. That's what I grew up listening to right there. And uh, that's kind of like what got me started. So we all started around the same time. There was a handful of, of Chicano rappers out at that time. and. Um, and those were the ones that I was listening to and bumping. Who I'd like to collab with in the future, I mean, just anybody that's positive, anybody doing it for the right reasons. Like right now, if you buy a Little Rob album, it's gonna be all Little Rob because I have like different kinds of music out there. I like to do different kinds of things. I grew up on uh, different music. My, my dad was in an oldie band. My mom would clean the house, listen to the blues. Uh, my brother was a DJ that got me into break dancing when I was in like third grade. And so I was brought up on freestyle and old school, like Zapp and Roger and stuff like that. Africa Bambata, you know, the old school rap. We're like, well, I'm little Rob and I'm slim in size. A t-shirt, Levi's is my only disguise. Built like a tank, yet hard to hit. Little Rob in the house, cold running, shit.